Welcome to part two of my attempt to build a bookshelf. In part one, you would have seen how we constructed the main frame of the bookshelf. And here we are attaching the backing board. The backing board helps create some structure and strengthen the bookshelf so it should stay straight. Or at least that is what I have been told. Once it's all put together, I'm using this wood filler to cover up all the holes that have been left by the bread nailer. Now look, I feel like it's probably time I should come clean. I'm not completely inexperienced at building things. In high school, I took part in mechanical engineering and product development. And in those classes, I learned woodworking and metalwork. I was also top in the class for both of those classes. With that being said, I have been out of school for many, many years and I'm definitely not as good as I used to be. And also as a mum, I don't have a lot of time to get these things done. So sometimes the quality of my work is somewhat questionable. With all that being said, I am 100% confident this bookshelf is not coming down anytime soon. The last thing for me to do with this bookshelf was nail in that little piece at the bottom, sand it all down once it had been filled and ta-da, we are done for the day. Keep an eye out for part three where it's painted and installed.